A house on Hamner Street was just another target late Tuesday night as the gun violence increases in Lafayette. News 10's Jasmine Dean spoke with Lafayette police and a local activist about what's being done to combat the rising number of shootings. Lafayette has seen an increase in gun violence. It's now at the point where the community needs to help the police. If there has ever been a time right now for the community to step up. The time is now. Sergeant Robin Green says when the police department is made aware of gun activity, they take action. Once we get the numbers or we get constant complaints from the community, what we do is we allocate different resources to that area. Devin Norman, president and director of the Village 337, says police are starting to do their part. So I believe that they're off to a um, somewhat of a good start by partnering with organizations like the Village 337, the NAACP, a number of other organizations that I've seen them partner with in the last few weeks. Sergeant Green says she understands why members of the community might be reluctant to give information on crimes in the area, but there are ways to discreetly inform the police. There are other ways other than just speaking to us when we're on scene. I mean, you can email us, you can call Crime Stoppers, you can call us. For more information on how to get involved in helping to decrease gun violence, we will have links on getting involved at KLFY.com. In Lafayette, Jasmine Dean, KLFY News 10.